In this segment, we're going to talk about the iWave It Tabula Rasa app. We start by launching the app, and in the top, you'll see a selection of different remote controls. You can choose these just like you would a normal universal remote control. If we tap on the Apple, it switches to the Apple remote control. Just tap on satellite, Blu-ray, etc. We can slide that bar back and forth. Now, these other remotes haven't been created yet, so we're going to go ahead and create the Blu-ray remote. We're going to tap on the Edit down in the lower left-hand corner. This brings up a menu, and we select Edit Remote. Now we're in the editing screen. We're going to add a button, and we're going to select a blank button, and the top one, the large round button. Now we have our first button. We can tap it, move it around, drag it around on the screen, and we want to add a background. Make it a little bit more interesting. Let's select the solid color, and go with dark teal. Of course, you can choose anything you want. Let's add a label. This brings up the label box. We tap in the middle, we get the keyboard. We can start typing in my first button. There we go. After we've done that, we can start adjusting the color. You have the RGB scale there. You can drag and drop them back and forth. We're going to go for yellow, so I'm going to drag the blue all the way to zero. Now I want to adjust the font size. I'm going to increase the font size by just scrolling this wheel up and down. And now I'm going to select the font. That's it. This is our first button. We can move that one around as well. Just tap it and move it around on the screen. In the next segment, we're going to talk about adding functions to buttons that we've created.